So you can see the ramp uh, down into the hole. That's to, uh, uh, they built that to get the crane down in there. In the next few days, they will actually set a crane pad in the bottom. And then this large crane coming up here, um, they're actually going to drive that down into the bottom, use that for not only removing dirt, but to also set up um, the large rings you see on the right hand side. Those are actually the jigs that they will use to pound the sheet piles down uh, to create basically a giant mold um, of the sub pit. So at the bottom of the screen here, you see the big stack of I-beams. Those are the pylons that they're about to start pounding into the ground. Those are actually designed not to hold the building up, but to hold the building into the ground because of its depth and the amount of water pressure that will be pushing against it. The engineers had to come up with a creative way to keep the building from floating. You can also see three black pipes sticking out of the center of the site. Those are actually wells that are about 55 feet deep. Those are to remove the nuisance water. They are pumping those 24 hours a day trying to keep the water below the ground that they're digging.